Right now we're on, I believe it's stage six against some sort of either boss or mini boss. It's probably just the mini boss to be honest with you. Every other stage has had a, ball, a mini boss of some type so far in this one. Just none of them have been quite this annoying. This is up there though. This is pretty, uh, pretty ridiculous. You can probably hear me banging on my controller furiously as this game is probably going to make me end up buying another Super Nintendo controller. They're getting harder and harder to find. I mean, the last one I had to order from China. On a completely unrelated note, again, like most of my comments, I use eBay pretty frequently here to locate a lot of my uh, Super Nintendo games because, as I mentioned before, I'm a pretty avid collector. And uh, just kind of on a whim, everyone kept saying how great uh, the new castle, well, I guess it's not new anymore, the Castlevania on DS was, uh, I forget which one, I think it's called the Ecclesia one, the Order of Ecclesia or something like that. So I found a deal on eBay that was uh, a pretty good price, I thought, for it. I think it was, um, how much was it, $17 new. And I looked on Amazon and it beat all the rates I saw there. So I was like, sure, what the hell. Ordered it, and I got an email confirming the order on eBay. It was from a, I thought it was a pretty reputable buyer. It said, your order's been placed. Uh, please allow uh, six to eight weeks for delivery. And I was like, why would it take that long? And then I looked at the shipping address, and it said, this item is being shipped in uh, from a ship over in China. And I, of course, I don't really care about that. Just the fact that I was going to have to wait even longer for my game, that's all. So I sat and waited and waited and tried contacting them after it was six weeks, and then seven weeks, and then eight weeks, and then after three months, I decided that enough was enough. I sent the seller an email, sent eBay an email saying, like, you know, what the, what's the deal here? You guys said this amount of time. It's been much, much, much longer than that. Uh, I don't really know where my item is. Uh, this is insane, by the way. Look at this. This guy has no life left, and he's still going to beat me. He just went on this like random like spree of killing me. I'm afraid to do anything since every move I've done before has been countered. One second here, guys. I gotta try to beat this guy. One more hit. Come on. Oh, ridiculous. Anyway, so uh, the seller finally contacted me back. I could tell that it was going to be one of those days because the seller's supposable contact email address name was, uh, uh, what was it, Eileen, but it was misspelled terribly, like so poorly I don't even know how to describe it. Um, finally I get a call back from someone, uh, I actually spoke with someone on the phone that spoke little to less than zero English, and they assured me the game was going to be there next week, etc., etc., and I said fine. So make sure the game's here next week and I won't contact eBay and anything else like that and give you a bad review. The game does show up the next week and it's a uh, copy game that has a printed manual that's three pages long. I beat him, thank God. Printed manual, three pages long, that looks like a kid drew with crayons and the game doesn't even work. And of course I checked the website and there's no way to transfer back. Slash Alex. Human worm, your pathetic little knife can't stop me. Your planet's mine to use up and destroy. I'm just a comma there, not an exclamation point. Okay, the final battle against a huge creature. Alright, looking forward to this here, guys. I'm sure it's going to be fair. I'm sure I'm going to have a lot of use for a lot of things here. So far, it's not going so good. To be honest, I'm being bounced left and right here. Don't really know where I even have to hit this guy here, so we're gonna. Oh, did something to that ball there. That was pretty cool. Let's try that again. We have to hit the ball back. That'd be a classic video game thing to do, wouldn't it? Hit the projectile back at the boss. That's like Zelda style right there. Ooh. That hit him or me? Have I hurt him yet? I think the answer to that question is no. Yeah, the answer to that question is no. I don't believe I've even heard him yet. I think the projectiles would do something to him, but I guess not. We'll try this again here. <clears throat> Alright, save state. Last boss. Here we go. 
Oh, that do something? Holy cow. Wait, 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 did you guys just see that? I think I saw it too. The crappy attack that had no use throughout the entire game is just destroying this boss. I don't even care. I'll walk up to you every time. You got half life. I got a full bar. What's up? Is this vengeance? Is this vengeance? I believe it is. Oh, wait. Tell me I was only the first half. Come on. Tell me it was only the first half. That'd be just perfect. Oh, yep. Only the first half. I knew that was too easy. It was like, no. Wow. He just took all of my life. That's okay. We're doing all right. We're in some sort of glitchy system here. Oh, that laser beam was no good, though. I don't think that's dealing any real damage to me. I'm expecting that laser beam to come back out any second here and just destroy my thoughts of one-shotting the boss. There it is. Can he do it? Can he do it? One more hit. Oh, no! Oh, God. Freaking classic. Just... Classic. There's no other words to describe what that just was besides classic. What, what, what? You can only kill him if he faces a certain direction? Is that what this deal is? Oh, I get it. He turns his head. He has to be on that side or something. I don't know. Whatever, I don't care. He's gonna die right now. Bam! Alright, you're going down this time. No uh, cheesy last minute technique gonna save you. Which was just shenanigans all right. This game is just full of shenanigans. I love that word. Oh, there's that claw of death. Where's the laser beam that's just gonna kill me? Oh my god, tell me now that because I had my like one shot at killing him, this is now just gonna be turned into another epic, epic awfulness. It seemed like last time I managed to block most of those things. I don't know how. Huh, you can try this with a little strategy, I guess. I guess that's a. Uh, I guess we're allowed to do that in this game. Seems like right there was, was a good spot until I just got shot right in the freaking mouth. See, I would try to do some strategy here, but again, the game rewards just me jumping around like an idiot, swinging my sword as rapidly as I can. The little red ball pisses me off every time. All right, let's try to do this here, guys. Let's try to focus and just get get the job done. Let's just get it done here. Don't jump into the laser beam of death. Okay, wrong decision right there. Just wrong all over the place. Does that do any more damage? No, of course not. Why would it? Why would my awesome attack do any more damage? That laser beam is just ridiculous. It has no show sign that it's gonna use it or anything like that. It just does it just for fun. I don't even know why. Alright guys, we've got eight and a half minutes here on the video, we're gonna be coming up close here. If I can avoid the next laser beam, which is undoubtedly coming, there it is. We'll drop a save state right there, and hopefully uh, we won't even need to use it. And this will be the end of Excalibur. Oh, there it is, there it is, there it is. That has to be it. That has to be it. Quick, use your awesome attack. Do it again. Your hair flies up when you do it. It looks like some sort of stupid anime character. Dragon Ball Z. Yay. Yay. Alright. <clears throat> Nine minutes here, guys. Hopefully we'll get to see the ending of this video. I can't imagine. Super Nintendo's got a very complex ending. Alex, where? Where am I, Slash? It's alright, Alex. It's over. I don't remember anything. Don't worry, everyone's alright. The warlords have fallen. Who are the warlords? We're free, let's go home. Is that really it? Oh yeah. Inspired by Slash and Alex, the people of Neo New York began to change. No longer terrorized by a crux raptor in their army of morphs, their people took control of their lives and their city and their jobs to do. There were parks to walk in. Oh, it was all about the parks. Thanks again for watching our first Let's Play here, guys. And we'll continue on, hopefully, with the next game, which is Secret of Evermore. Thanks a lot.